new video. In this one, I'll be recreating an Arabic inspired look using gold glitter. Okay, to start off with, I'm using the ABH Dip Brow in the shade Chocolate, and I'm just using this to shape the brows. I've already sculpted the brows using the MAC for Longwear Concealer in the shade NC20. I'm now using the MAC Paint Pot in the shade Soft Ochre just to go over the eyes and I'm using this as a base. I'm now using a MAC Eyeshadow in the shade Gesso and I'm using this in the inner corners and on the brow bone as a highlight. Using the Urban Decay Gwen Stefani palette, I'm taking the shade Stark and I'm using this as my transitioning shade. intensifying this shade using a burnt orange shade from the Morphe 35B palette. As I wanted to recreate a dramatic Arabic inspired look, I've added tape to the corners of the eyes. Now this is just so that it makes it a little bit easier for me to get the sharp edge that I needed. Next, using a pencil brush, I'm taking a black colour and placing this on the outer V of her eye and I'm just blending this out to create a seamless finish. The key to a smoked out look is to be patient and gradually build the colour. eyeliner brush I am drawing a thin line around her crease. I will then take another brush and blend this out.
the brush and taking the matte full on wear concealer in the shade NT20 and I'm drawing around the line that I created just to get a sharp look crease look. Using the same burnt orange shade I'm just blending out the crease from the Morphe palette and then taking the MAC pigment in the shade Melon and placing this onto the lid. I am now repeating this on the other eye. Applying gold glitter directly onto the pigment I placed onto the eyes. I'm applying lashes onto um, this lovely lady. Later I realised that these lashes were actually quite too big for her eyes um, so I did take them off, um, snip them down to her correct size and then place them back on. Unfortunately, the battery to my camera had run out, so I was unable to film the foundation routine. But I used the Illamasqua Rich Liquid Foundation in the shades 210 and 233 mixed together. Um, and then I also took the Artist of Makeup Contour Stick in the shade Dark and used this for the contour. And I'm now taking the Cryolan um, Blusher Palette and I'm using the Peachy Shades. I'm then taking the Amy H that glow palette um, and I'm using this to highlight her skin.
lined her lips, I'm using the MAC Lip Liner in the shade Soul. Um, and I also use this to fill in her lips. And then I take a similar shade from the Bobbi Brown palette um, to use as a lipstick. There you go guys, that's the final look. I hope you enjoyed this video. If there's any suggestions or any other videos you'd like me to have a go at, please let me know in the comments below um, and please subscribe and like. Thank you.